There's no place like home for the holidays Cause no matter how far away you roam When you pine for the sunshine of a friendly gaze For the holidays you can be home sweet home We met a man who lives in Tennessee And he was heading for Pennsylvania and some homemade pumpkin pie. From Pennsylvania, folks are traveling down to Dixie's sunny shore. From Atlantic to Pacific, G. The traffic is terrific. Oh, there's no place like home for the holidays. Cause no matter how far away you roam, if you want to be happy. Yeah, you know something? We're really lucky we live in a place where we can bring in our own living tree. You know, people in the cities have to buy a tree from a Christmas tree lot. Yeah. Know? It's a thought that counts, though, Donnie. I'm sure a lot of families have just as much fun going out and buying a tree. Yeah, I, I guess so, Alan, but it sort of loses something for me when a salesman says, Hi, friends, and welcome to Kenny's light new Christmas tree showroom. How about this beautiful number here, formerly owned by a little squirrel who lived in it on Sundays? <laughs> trees up and it'll be decorated in plenty of time for Christmas. Uh -huh. right. In two more days. That's right, that's right Don. Hell, I have a feeling this will be the best Christmas ever. Yeah, that's what we all said one time, and that was the year the tree fell over after we finished decorating it. <laughs> yeah, the candy cane smashed. And the ornament broke. Yeah. And the light short circuited. <laughs> hey, well, if you all remember right, the tree didn't exactly fall over. Donnie tried to climb that's it. That's right. <laughs> that's right. That's because he heard Father say there should be a star on top of the tree. Uh, <laughs> real funny, guys. Okay, look. Yeah. I will admit that I did try to climb the tree. What do you expect from a two-year-old baby? Huh? <laughs> Donnie. Yes. You weren't two, you were 14. 